It is hot. Boy, is it hot. It's September in Florida. Getting close to October, which is what I'm really waiting for. The turkey oaks are turning brown. And that means autumn's on its way. But for me, the best thing about September is October is coming next. And that's my favorite month of the year. Not because it's my birthday, but because the cymus will start hatching and coming up. But being it's September still, I got to get out and do some stuff. So I'll be going out looking for diamondbacks and cane breaks. And anything else that crosses my way, I can't wait. So let's get at it. Didn't I say a token diving bag? Yeah. Didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now that is a baby. I think that's pretty much newborn. Yeah, that, that's fresh born. Yeah, look at the little button. Right here in this area, in the sand hills, I found Simus before. Um, it's mid September. What's really cool is that underneath all that cover, under this dirt there, there's baby Simus ready to pop out. They'll bloom in October. I'm going to be there. So there's a drawer. There's two of them. Yeah, there's a drawer salamander. Yeah, there's two of them right there. Is there a drawer? Yeah. And look, just flip your camera down. Or towards you. Yeah, see, there's the other one. Oh, yeah. Nice. I'm gonna ask, fuck it, I'm gonna get a picture because <laughs> those things are so hard to photograph on the road. <clears throat> This is crazy, look at you all work. 
yeah. September is slow in Florida, but there's one thing you can go after, and that's the croats, eastern diamondbacks, canebrake rattlesnakes in North Florida. The babies are being born for those right now, so they can be found crossing roads. You'll start seeing people, seeing them in their yards, etc. And uh, they're pretty easy to get right now if you go out on a good day when it's not raining or or too uh, hot, etc. Usually in the evenings is the best time for them, or the early mornings. We just got a cane break. It's a baby. First, the baby diamondback. It's the time of the year, so that's why we're out. I don't think it was anywhere close to. Now see, he's coiled there, he could actually strike at me. Oh, he's pulled. Well, there you go. Over the weekend, we got the baby diamond back, and then the next day, towards the evening, probably around seven, we got the cane break, both babies. As I said earlier, the babies are being born now, um, but the adults are also moving around. They are breeding this time of year, so a lot's happening when it comes to uh, diamondbacks and cane breaks. So hopefully, I'll be able to get an adult sometime in September but while I'm looking for Simus they always just show up so I'm sure I'll see one in October maybe early November so just keep going let's get at it Walking around today in a prescribed burned area. And got this little teeny tiny oak toad. This thing is tiny. The adults are probably about an inch, inch and a half at the most. But these little guys, they're, they're really cool. You can tell these by the little stripe on the back. He was just hopping around right here when I got out of the car. There he goes. <laughs> I'm in a burned area in central Florida. It was burned yesterday. So I'm gonna check this area out. And I've got a diamond back that was trapped. Between the fires, uh, we moved it out yesterday and bringing it back today to release it. Get some photos and uh, let it go on its way. 